Hey guys, Donnie from Diamond She Designs here. If you want to see how I turn this TV stand into a book chair slash toy box for my son, I'm going to show you. So stay tuned. You want a book or you want a toy? Um. Well, let's read, man. Before we dive into this video, if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel so you can be notified when new projects come out. All right, so first step is to remove the drawers. We gotta cut away all the material that we're not gonna need. Open up the seat. Let's go. Cut it away at the seam. Ride that straight back in a straight line. Repeat that on the right side as well. So now that we have it down to the bare bones, all we have to do is measure out material for the back piece, for the sides, for the seat, and for dividers for the drawer. So let's get to it. Look at that. this is how far we've gotten. We have our seat, we have our walls, we have our divider in our drawer. What's next is to sand everything down, paint everything, install the cushions, and then we might have something cool. Maybe. <laughs> so you're gonna need a few more supplies for this project. Foam cushions, fabric, staples, adhesive spray, and a stapler. But what worked for me was to lay my cushions down on the plywood, trace out everything that I have to cut away, then cut everything off. Make sure to spray the back of the foam and also the plywood. Now it's time to wrap. So when we're talking about wrapping techniques, pretend like you're wrapping a present. Be sure to pull it each side really tight. The next step is prep for paint. We're gonna sand everything down, put tape everywhere we don't want paint at, and just spray away. What are you doing? Come on. Come on. Come on.
So the level of difficulty of this project was about a three out of 10. Still had a blast making this. I know my son is gonna enjoy it too. Something else for him to jump off of. But I really appreciate you for tuning in. If you have any ideas, leave them in the comments and I hope to see you soon. Thank you.